The ISS is the world's most fantastic laboratory in space. It's the only one that can take gravity out of the equations. ISS research is important because you can take experiments and run them in space and run them on the ground and they'll be fundamentally different. People are developing drugs, vaccines on the space station. So these things can happen uh, in space which have great applications here on the planet. Of course, STEM is necessary for space. Space is still the forefront of technology, so people need to have that, that background, that educational background. STEM is important because if you think about the next generation of uh, scientists, engineers, and leaders, the young persons of today are looking at what's the next frontier for exploration. They see space as it. Genes in Space is a uh, student program from uh, seventh grade to twelfth grade, given an opportunity for them to study the DNA of human genes in space and run an experiment that the crew would do on orbit. Competitions like Genes in Space give the young scientists everywhere an opportunity to do something they wouldn't otherwise do. I mean, how many students get a chance to study science in microgravity? For astronauts who, especially on if we're looking to do long duration space flights in the future, the International Space Station, while it's definitely far away, it's much closer to Earth, much more connected than a Mars mission or a deep space mission. The, the next sort of great journey uh, for mankind in terms of manned space exploration is, of course, the, the manned mission to Mars. That's what everyone's pumped about, but um, it's important that we understand astronaut health before we attempt something really ambitious like that. ISS is part of the journey to Mars, and our part is to develop and mature technologies that are required to go to Mars with the laboratory that we have in low Earth orbit. We can test systems that are essential to maintaining the health and the safety of our crew members for three years to go to Mars and back. So we're just in the infancy of exploring space. We need people to carry on for generations after us. And I think, therefore, working in the space industry really is uh, this idea of looking towards the future.